Hey guys, my name is Sam Snight, and welcome back to Castlevania Harmony of Dissonance. I went ahead, I got back here. I'm not sure I like it, but... Uh, this is the plan. We're going into here again. Ooh. Ooh. Alright. Whack! I've actually... J oh, hang on a second. I can't see the bottom. Oh, not what I wanted to do. Not what I wanted to do. Now I'm making it worse, not better. Hang on. <laughs> Probably should have had this done and ready. But I am a fool. Don't you know by now. There we go. So. Um, I'm genuinely enjoying this one. I didn't not enjoy Circle of the Moon. I have a lot of sentimental ties to Circle of the Moon. But I'm having more fun with this one already in the short time that I've actually been playing this. Uh, than I did with Circle of the Moon. And I, I feel like... I, I'm, I'm fairly certain this is the first game after Symphony that Iga had a part in. If I'm not mistaken. Because I know he had nothing to do with Circle of the Moon. And that I feel like might be what was missing for me in Circle of the Moon. Don't get, don't get me wrong. It was a good game. I enjoyed it. It just didn't feel as Metroidvania as I'm used to. That's my preferred style. I mean, you could call me a normie if you want you can call me someone who you know just likes the 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 mainstream stuff when it comes to castlevania because there are choices about castlevania some people always make is when i talk because i have i am actually believe it or not there are other people who like castlevania out there um hi scuba okay this is what killed me last time we're gonna just we're just gonna back up we're gonna just drink one of these Um, I know other people that like Castlevania. I've spoken to many. A lot of them actually work with me, which is cool. Um, and even the ones that have only played a few, when I hear what are the best Castlevanias, the same three always seem to come up. Okay. Now, don't get me wrong. There are instances where other ones will. But the ones that I hear the most are Symphony of the Night, Super Castlevania 4 and uh, Rondo of Blood. Those are the three that I hear the most. I would say Symphony and 4 come up the most and Rondo is a close third. Okay. Yes, Scooby, I love you. Oh, shit. Hang on. Scub. Um, my, obviously, my personal favorite and my favorite video game of all time is Symphony of the Night. But I will say, I'm very much enjoying this. Now, I was discussing with AJ, with, with my buddy AJ, uh, this seems like an empty room. There's gotta be more to this. Do you wanna lay down? You can if you want, Scoob. Whenever you want, just go ahead and just kind of park yourself. Um. Oof. Oof. Um. <clears throat> oh, God, I can't even remember my train of thought now. This whole thing wasn't for a potion. There's something else in here. Yes, Gooba. You have my attention. The cat distracted the hell out of me. Something's up in this room. There's no way that's all that there is in there. I would say... Now... Oh, yeah, I was discussing with AJ. Um, I really like Portrait of Ruin. It's my favorite DS game. Uh, AJ believes that the story could have been better. And at first I was like... The story was fine. I, there was like actual like investment in the characters, and I, I cared about the sisters, and and even uh, Bronner to an extent. I understood because I like when they make the villains' motives understandable. Um, even the, the shade, what was his name? The, uh, the shade that you like learned from. He looked kind of like a cowboy. 
Uh, I can't remember his name. It's been a minute. Sage statue? Hello? Sage statue? Relics? No? Oh. Statue of a smug looking old man. Um, he told me that it was like set in the 1940s, late 30s, uh, early 40s, which I never really pay attention to that too much. Okay, that's a door I can't get through yet. Um, think about, like, Dracula in World War II era. That's, uh, albeit problematic, but we have games about Nazi zombies and stuff. So, like, it's not that it's, like, a forbidden place to go when it comes to video games. So, Dracula in the World War II era would be something I wouldn't mind seeing. I'd be... Like, Nazi vampires? I, I, I don't know. There's just... There's... Oh. That's a big slime! Whoopsie. I can barely move. Okay. Oh, wow. That was easy. Okay. That was shocking. Oh, shit. Okay. Okay. I just want to fight another boss. Ah. Silver dishes. No, stupid. Okay, I made it through. Holy shit, this place is never ending. I also have a theory that there, there's got to be a second castle involved in this somehow. Or a second area or something. Because, I'll be honest with you. The, uh... That number, 13579. 13579. I'm gonna remember that. That's just the first five odd numbers. Oh, you shit face. God, that's a far way up. Um. Whoa. I keep. I have so many tangents that I'm on right now that I can't remember all of them. Um. Nazi Dracula, that'd be kind of cool. Although I don't see him following Hitler, he might actually even be Hitler, who knows. Dimitri and I even killed Hitler on this channel before. And we played, uh... Life Max, uh, that was worth it. I get my ass kicked a lot, this is gonna be nice to have a little bit more life. What are we at? What are we at? Oh my god. So this is all a dead end down here. This was all for one life max up. I've been recording. Half the episode's gone! And I ain't done shit. Oh. You're gonna make me actually edit? God forbid I actually do m what I my hobby.
Nice! So we call advancement. Ah, oh, shit. This is a problematic area right here. I am not missing anything, correct? At least, unless it's a secret. This whole area of the game seems to be empty-ish when it comes to bosses. Oh, shit! I'm not prepared for this at all. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oof! Okay, 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 okay. It's fine. I wasn't ready for this at all. I accidentally charged my way into here. Okay, hang on. Whoop, wrong thing. Items, potion. Oh, that's a lot of health. Bye, Scoob. Did I win? Yeah, I was gonna say there's no way. Ooh. Yuck. Uh oh. <laughs> what if? Hey! Yeah, bitch. This was only a surprise boss fight because I'm an idiot. Which seems to be a common theme amongst my Let's Plays is I'm just an idiot. All, all done! Teabag. Danger falling rocks! Love it. Okay. We're gonna quick save. I love that, by the way. It's a big win. What is this shit? What? Oh, okay. Is this another boss? Just because the last one was super easy? <clears throat> This seems okay. I, I I guarantee you it'll get unbearable. That was a good duck, if I do say so myself. Ew, that's gonna come to life, right? No, up. Uh, nope, nope. Ah, I want nothing to do with this shit. Quit. Shit, shit, shit! Uh, I think it's worse now. 
Oh god. That was really bad. What are these? Strange mirror, Yellowstone. What's the Yellowstone do? Adds lightning! Dig that. How the f Yeah, I'm not about to. Mm -hmm. oh! Well, I want out of here. Something's up with that. Ah, uh, I gotta have, like, some type of wall jump or double jump or some shit. That's fine. I need to save, like, actually. Where do I need to be going? Okay. So I'm gonna save, and then I can't remember if that room was actually accessible to me up there or not. I don't believe it was. Because I want to make sure I hit all my dead ends now, so that way I can officially say that I've, like, moved on to the next stage in the Metroidvania style, so to speak. Ah, will you... Yeah, no, this is something I can't undo. So, I have to go. Oh, there's an uppy and a downy back over there. Always safe. Why not? Ah. Well, that was well placed. Is this the down that I haven't gone? It is. Uh, bah, 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 bah. Not looking to fight everything. Man, not one single. Ah, oh, shit. Mm, that's not the worst. Ooh. Well, let's go all the way over here and see if it's a dead end that's worth leaving. Now, see, it's not even a dead end, so I might as well get this now. Unless it's a dead end. I'm gonna guess one of these secret rooms eventually. That's not good. Anytime the game gives you stuff without you having to try is a very bad sign. I'm anxious. I can't get up there. God bless it. Okay, there's one. <clears throat> there's an uppy. You guys are coming on this journey with me. Because, I mean, this is only going to be a 10 to 12 episode thing like most Castlevania games are on my channel. So, like, I've already accepted that. I know that these don't get the most amount of views. They're more for me. If, uh, I mean, not as a rewatch, but as, like, a documentation that I've beaten this whole series. I, I did say I was going on this journey. I gotta get to that save room. Save and then go uppies. 
Uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and save just so that's like locked in. Nice. Oh man, we're only a couple minutes away from being done with this episode, huh? Well, let's. Shit. Well, that's fine. It happened. I can't get up there. Turquoise. It's such a weird up. Um, oh, there's one down I missed way back. I'll actually uh, pause before I get to it and oh, let me kill her first. Alright, so I'm gonna take us to that down from back over by the keyhole almost. Not one second after pausing the recording I got this as a drop. I don't know if it's any good. Um about to find out though. Oh, yeah, okay. Uh, that takes it up by one. It takes it up by one. It takes it up by one. Okay. Nice. Cool. Okay, barely, but I made it. This is where I stopped this way, so I'm going to go ahead and potion up. I don't know what's in here. I don't know if I like that sound. Okay, well, I can't get up there yet. Oh. Okay. Oh, yeah, I, I got the punchies on the way here. What, what do I get for beating this guy? Nothing. This whole, that whole thing was, oh, there is a room down there, I guess. Oh, that's right. So that wasn't worth anything. Okay, well. Then let's look at the map. It appears as if the only thing I can do with what I've got is go back through the keyhole and go get some of those uh, gray things. But we... I'm going to get over there in between episodes. Yeah, I'm going to end it right here. So be sure to check in for the next one because I want to see you there.